blind matrix users so uh, hope you everyone is doing fine um, this is ram here and i'm happy to share with you uh, some changes that is going to be implemented uh, next week um, so this is just on the uh, uh, application desktop application wherein um, we are making some ui changes especially on the design of the application with some tweaks on certain things so that is what we're gonna see in this video wherein uh, I will just give you a glimpse of what's in store so that uh, you guys would be um, known prior to the release that this is what gonna be changed and where certain things would be uh, moved along with the new release so um, this is the uh, design so if you could see like the search screen um, uh, the entire design on the background has been changed and please make a note that all the functionalities of the modules will remain the same only the look and feel of the application has been changed so a couple of tweaks would be if you see the create new um, that remains the same and then uh, in in the current uh, design you will have the search option and uh, now what we have done is just made a change wherein uh, within this explore we have kept it as explore and within this particular explore option you will have your search screen and then there is an also an um, option to look at the archive orders as well so this archive folders will have your archive orders and uh, the search screen will uh, function as usual like how it is functioning right now only the look and feel it's getting changed and the place where it uh, was placed has been changed now it will be underneath the explore option and then your work in progress will remain the same and then calendar uh, if you take a look this is how the new calendar page would look like uh, the design and other stuffs and but the functionalities will remain the same as you are currently using and then a um, couple of uh, major uh, changes that needs to be uh, uh, understood would be um, you might be seeing like uh, you are not looking at uh, sent emails and text message uh, field here which you are currently having in the system so what we have done we have grouped that into uh, something called notification so once you click here that will give you an option for your text message as well as your sent emails so this is where you need to make sure you go in order to test uh, I mean check the test messaging and send emails and then um, all the other things remain the same um, let's say one more thing would be on your order page uh, where you have the order so let's get into one test order and um, so when 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 you are using the desktop version for sending out the codes invoice or the credit notes uh, in the current system uh, I mean this current design what you will have once you get into an order in the left hand side of the panel you will see like quotation invoice all the reports um, mentioned over there but what we have done it's like uh, we have grouped the report also so if you want to create send a quotation to a customer or an invoice um, in the new UI what you need to do it's like just expand this reporting that will give you an option of uh, kind of report that you need to send so uh, the, all, the re all the other functionality remain the same. Once you click on the quotation, um, the quotation will get generated and you will uh, send it across to your customers via email. So uh, these are the changes uh, that will be released by mid of next week. And uh, once the release happens, uh, we will uh, just let you guys know so that uh, you guys will be ready uh, to um, use the new UI changed application um, and get used to it as well um, yeah so that's pretty much uh, on this video and once this goes live I will just uh, keep everyone posted and uh, hopefully um, this will be a good one and uh, thank you and uh, talk to you guys soon bye bye